Hi friends, Miss Hillary here from New Kensington Room 11 Pre-K Counts. And I wanted to share a fun activity that can help fill the time. Um, if you're at home, if you're in the middle of doing something, or even if you're on a car ride and um, you're getting a little bit bored or you're anxious to get there, um, this is a Mighty Minute and it's number 59. It's called Clap the Beat. And um, it's it sort of helps us to listen to break down parts of a word um, into syllables. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to create patterns by using the words and we're going to clap our hands as we use, I'm sorry, as we say these words. And since we've been talking about healthy foods over the last couple weeks, I was going to use some of those foods as the syllables for our activity today. So the first food that we were going to look at is an apple. How many syllables do we have in the word apple? Apple. Apple. Two. There are two parts to the word apple. This word is fish. Fish. How many times did I clap? One. Fish only has one syllable. And we clap one time. Fish. What about this fruit? What is this called? Water melon. Water melon. How many times do we clap in watermelon? Water melon. One, two, three, four. We clap four times for watermelon. What's this a piece of? Cheese. How many syllables are in the word cheese? One. So I'm going to put it next to fish for one cheese. Here's another one that has several syllables. Do we remember what this is called? Pine apple. It has the word apple, which has two, and it has the word pine at the beginning, which has one. So two and one make three. Two plus one equals three. Pine apple. So our pineapple has three syllables. You can also use this when you're driving. If you see a cow or if you see a horse or a puppy, you can count the syllables in your name. Hillary has one, two, three. And you can change different items. So you can even say apple, banana, apple, banana. And you can sort of make a pattern as you go along and it can keep you busy, but also help you to practice how to break down words and get ready for reading. Have a great day, friends, and let me know what, how many syllables you find in the words that you explore.